Hey everybody, Carbery Jesus with you. Welcome. We're gonna do the Elite Football number four, Rip City Card style right now. You can come in this direction. Alright, this is a uh, fresh case of Elite. I have not opened this yet, so this is gonna be fun and exciting for me as long as well as everyone else. Throw that out of there. I mean, I gotta say that there is not a team in the NFC East. Like, if it, I mean, I, it's not humanly possible. But if it were possible, you know, I think this is gonna be slidey. So yeah, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna pack, stack, and buy box. If every team, if every team in the NFC East could go 0 and 16, I would, I'd be happy with it. I mean, I guess you could go like 0 8 and 8. That would, I mean, that would, that that could potentially be a be a situation. It's going to take a quick minute because of Panini's pack foolery. Click on that. I don't know, rah rah. I mean, I don't. I don't know if you even want to. If you want to bother with us, I mean, you've got a good enough reputation that it could just be uh, rah rah nose cards. Yes, and we have a state minimum wage. That we would probably pay you. Or just make you a, a 1099 employee for said 25 cents an hour. And then and then work you work you to the bone for that. I have made this uh, more difficult, could they? Oh, the Bucks are my only team, Sean, and I can't watch them play because nobody wants to ever see them on uh, national television. So I get to live with the uh, joy of uh, of hating hating all teams. 
and really only uh, really only deciding like day of televised game which team I uh, hate less, which is always really the team that's worse. Except that uh, I've gotten back into fantasy football the last couple of years. Jade, I honest to God don't even know. Honest to God don't even know. But I'm willing to work for it if uh, if benefits are involved. Now listen, I mean, the man's hungry. Sean, what do you want from him? He's hungry. You know? And, uh, I mean, he's not getting W's, you know, enough for him to, uh, to, to satisfy his hunger. So, it's, it's the Dolphins uh, getting embarrassed by somebody or whatever other, you know, or, or the, the Giants. Or the Raiders, or the uh, Steelers on uh, national TV. No, Jerry has got the uh, Vikings in four. I will get the I'll, I'll get the list up once I get this open. I don't know, man. I mean, listen, we got a new coach. We got, we got, we got Bruce Arians now, man. Bruce Arians in the building, and and, and Bruce, we trust Bucko Bruce. Is uh, what it is now. Oh hell's yeah, Shane, dude. If I was Bridgewater, I mean, cause I mean, he's still technically pretty young. You know, I mean, as, I mean, as far as like football age goes, sit for the Saints. You know, I mean, get fully healthy, learn, because I mean, he was a decent, a decent quarterback with the, you know, with the Vikings. I don't, I don't think he's a bad QB. Learn Sean Payton's system. Wait for uh, Breeze to finally be like, eh, I, I think I'm going to go ahead and stay home with my, uh, my with my 22 kids. Why not? Oh, the A train and uh, work done. Maybe one of the best one-two punches ever. In uh, foosball, Jamie, how you doing? Yeah, I mean Shane. I mean Drew Brees is what? He turned fifty-seven, fifty-seven. He turned fifty-eight. You know, in uh, in February this year. So you know, I mean, he's 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 getting up there. I mean, and the Saints have weapons. You know, it's not like it's not like the Saints don't have targets for even a moderately decent QB to throw to. So I mean, so you know, I mean, Bridgewater can't can't step in that role. I mean, I'm gonna hate him even more as well. Tom Brady is a lizard man. I mean, is is kind of what it boils down to. He is a lizard man. I didn't really want to talk conspiracy, you know, theory here, but I but I'm going to. Tom Brady is part of a uh, lizard race. 
that is uh, trying to take over uh, take over the world. I mean, I, I don't think that dude eats tomatoes. How do you not eat tomatoes? That makes you a lizard person. I seriously think we're going to find out that Tom Brady is some kind of like a cyborg thing in like the next like five or six years that is then going to change the NFL instead of being played with human beings to be played with uh, you know, weird cyborg people. I hate Tom Brady. Nameth, uh, Nameth Darnold Duel. Consider it done. So all you had, all you had to do was ask. Two autographs, one memorabilia per box. We got, we got many chances. Oh, he doesn't. He doesn't play for my team, Rah Rah. He doesn't play for my team. So of course I have to hate him. No, I do not. Uh, I do not dispute that he is that he is the best that's ever played. I don't dispute that at all. And if anyone were to, were to ever ask me, I would I would tell them that that uh, as long as I have ever watched the. Uh, Game of foosball, I have never seen anyone as good at it. Well, no, I mean, I, I, again, because he is like a lizard man, I imagine that by the time she's like in school, like that'll be like kind of like washed from uh, education and stuff. But dude, I mean, even even in that Falcon Super Bowl, when they were getting obliterated a half, like I, I had no doubt in my mind that he was that he was going to come back. I was, I mean, I was absolutely shocked that he didn't do it against the Eagles. But the Eagles had, I mean. Had a decent enough defense, and you and you and you literally can't win every game. So that you know is what it is. But no, I've ne I've never seen anybody a, a better a better quarterback. Never. I mean, the only the only thing that would have been like mildly interesting to see would have been either Belichick without Brady or Brady without Belichick. But that's not going to happen. Like they're, but I mean, when one goes, the other one goes. That I think is like almost an absolute, and that's fine because I like Belichick too. I mean, I, I mean, as much as I hate hate the Patriots. I love Belichick's attitude. I enjoy watching his uh, his uh, conference, like his uh, you know pre press conferences where he says nothing. Like I don't think he owes the media anything as far as information or chat chat type stuff goes.
Just wear your, wear your cut off cut off hoodie and just uh, do and just do what you do. Show up there for the three minutes that you that you have to and, uh, and do it. I mean, listen. I, to me, not even just Patriots fans. I mean, I. I mean, I. I wish that there were more coaches that you know they just didn't like spit out. You know, like the uh, you know the we're we're putting a a team effort out, and you know we're just gonna have to see how this works out. And that, I mean, you know, just the. The the all too typical spitting out of of just regular sports talk garbage. You know the like. Well, you know, I mean, we're definitely going to want to try and uh, try and sc score more points. Uh, you know than, than the uh, Colts this game. You know, like I, I feel like if we can uh, you know put up put up more points, uh, more yardage, and hold them to fewer points and. Uh, and less yardage, then we're gonna have a shot. You know, then we're gonna have a shot to win. Uh, you know that that kind of mess, like it's just, it just you know, it, to me is unnecessary. No coach. You know, is there is there going you know going to be saying like ah oh, well you know it, it, if 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 my safety hadn't played like garbage, you know. It, you know, and blown those, you know, blown those four uh, plays, and you know, maybe we would won. Or... It's just stupid. It's just stupid. You don't, you don't need to talk that much. Just play the game. Like it was funny. I, I don't normally watch the show, but uh, Family Guy, that cartoon. Anybody, anybody uh, know that one? I, it happened to be on. And the remote control was too far from my hand to uh, change it, so I just left it on. And it happened to be like the Thanksgiving episode, where the main guy Stan was uh, was getting ready to watch, you know, uh, Redskins Giants or Redskins Cowboys, and he's a like a, a Redskins fan. Not, not that it matters, but he he was up at like six o'clock in the morning. You know, getting ready for like the pregame stuff, and one of like the the Fox pregame things in the cartoon was somebody waking up Jimmy Johnson like out of bed. You know, to you know, to to get him up, and that's almost what it feels like. That like we're doing nothing but just you know talking about it for an it just an unnecessary amount of time. Like how many times can you discuss an injury report or who's doing this or who's doing that? Well, see, that's one that I also like about uh, that. I think I think I'm thinking about right. Bruce Arians when he was with the uh, Colts, like somebody asking him, like how much the uh, how much the backup QB was like, you know, was was practicing or you know, like how how many reps he was getting or something. And he just told him like, listen, like if. It, it, if Manning, like I, th I think he was like number s maybe number six at the time, like if number six not playing, it doesn't matter who's who's playing QB. So like you know, it, somebody actually actually telling some truth. Do you, I mean listen? Decent quarterbacks are hard to come by, Shane. I mean I'm not. I'm not surprised that people are going to pay for somebody that is decent. You know, I don't maybe necessarily believe it, but uh, 
as as someone who has a uh, who who has a questionable quarterback in Jameis Winston, who I still believe in. I still believe that crab man going to be eating some W's this year. You know, finding somebody to replace them. That's a whole big, whole big bit hard. And I mean, I, he, I mean, I, he has to be. He can't, he can't be worse. Wide receivers, tight ends, set. Defense is the defense is the mess. I mean, he wouldn't throw as many interceptions as he does if we were not constantly down by fifth by 18, 20 points a game. Like in him having to try and come back. Our defense is terrible. 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 He not bad. I still like him. I mean, I'm not. I, I'm not. Uh, I'm not looking to get rid of him. I know. I know a lot of Buccaneer fans. I read the boards. I'm like, oh, get rid of him. You know, just cut him. Just cut him. You know, and, 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 and and replace him with who? That's see. That's my. That's always my question, especially quarterback wise. You, you want to get rid of your guy? Who are you going to replace him with? Who are you going to replace him with? No, Fitzpatrick is Harvard educated smart. There's a, there is a there is a actual Fitzpatrick system that works. That he is like crazy good for just enough games to get him like a max backup potential starter deal. Then he ends up tanking like enough games that he gets put on the bench. He's still collecting his dollars. And then moves into the next situation. It's gonna be the same thing this year. I, I mean, I love me some Fitzpatrick. Love me some Fitzpatrick. But you know, if if, if I if I will be re, if I will be real about it for a minute, I mean Fitzpatrick is a great example that he he has excellent talent. He has excellent talent. But he's like he's not not consistent enough to be the guy, you know. And I mean, again, I do, I do love him. Like he is fun, dude. I mean, the, some my the favorite thing that ever happened to me last year was seeing him uh, wear that. Uh, where that where that dude stuff, but I mean that's just like I mean he he balls out in enough games to get somebody to bring him on to back up or potentially start, usually with a youngish quarterback. I mean, and it works for him. I mean, he, he's gonna, he's gonna be like forty seven years old by the time he retires. And it's going to be worth like a billion dollars in uh, in NFL money just just from his just from his contract. I mean, I don't know how good the Dolphins are, like line wise this year, because that'll make the big difference between like Rosen getting stomped. And it's Patrick getting uh, you know, beaten to death. We're just we're just gonna have to see. We're gonna have to see. Oh my God, sweet mother of mercy! That was a lot of uh, a lot of packs to open. Oof. I mean, 
if I was Fitzpatrick, once once I quit the NFL, I would just be a uh, a beard model. I would get on with uh, that like five dollar shave shave club or whatever that sells like the you know like the beard lotions and stuff like that. And I would just uh, sell uh, sell beard lotions, you know, fr- from my uh, from my Bugatti. Okay, so I have not seen this yet, but I am very much interested to see what this is going to look like. This is nothing. All right, we got some base cards. A uh, Patrick Peterson. Oh, so is there is there like an actual set of playing type cards? Oh, there was kids reporters. I had forgotten about those. Hey, Will Greer autograph to uh, 75 for the Panthers. At least we've got uh, non college stuff. Hate that, uh, that piece of crap doo doo face. But he is a good quarterback. He is a good quarterback. Kind of ways for the old man, the breezy. We've uh, discussed earlier. To two ninety nine, a uh, Emmett Smith. Got AJ Brown to two ninety nine. Pen pals for uh, Ryan Finley of the Bengals. I you know I need it. I need to get myself a Ryan Fitzpatrick autographed football. You've made it. You've made it perfectly clear to me, Zach. I mean, I guess if you want in, if you want the information that I promise to provide you, yeah, sure. I mean, if you're gonna be, I mean, if you're gonna be a real a hole about it, like I feel like you are right now, asking me to do things that I should have already done, you know, then we may have to discuss. I may have to cut you back, Zach, from uh, breaking 12 hours a day at the National to breaking 10 hours a day for uh, you know for for what for what you're for what you're uh, doing to me right now. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna cut you. I'm gonna cut you a sl- slack on this one, Zach. You're back 12 hours breaking at the National to 24. A uh, Gary Jennings Jr. status uh, die cut for the uh, Seahawks uh, football organization. Now, yeah, e- yeah, I would take anyone, Shane. I, I may have to. Uh, uh, maybe it's better. I don't look forward tonight. A uh, Stidham to ninety nine because I would probably overspend. A uh, Gilmore, but now now I kind of want one. A uh, Derek Carr die cut to uh, ninety six. Field Vision, who has that Saquon to two ninety nine. Come on. An elite company, DK Metcalf. Yeah, it's going to be uh, random. <laughs> can you can you take it off once it's once it's done or no? If I add, if I add him to moderator, will that will that kick off the? Uh, the time limit. A uh, Nicole to uh, six ninety nine for the Chiefs. Quentin Williams to two ninety nine. Gary Jennings Jr. just a uh, straight rookie card. Ryan Finley and that's a uh, card looking deal.
Yes, Sean, tell me. The main player on the front, like for these, are you talking about? The Elite Company deal? Because, I mean, that, I mean that, that card says DK Metcalf. It says DK Metcalf on the back. It has the... Yeah, I mean, to me, that that's a DK Metcalf card. To me, that there's... I mean, that's just how it is. These All these other folks... It is what it is. I mean, I mean, his name there, his name there. Like that's that's his to me. Kirk Cousins Swatchery for the Vikings. Uh, Jersey G Man probably not. I mean, I, I mean, I don't know. he occasionally pops in, but he always seems to. Let me know if he does. And I imagine he has better things to do tonight than uh, be watching me. Hoxon to 88. Rookie action. Chris Campbell to 699. A uh, Foster Moreau to uh, 699 for the Raiders. I mean, listen, Jersey G, man. I mean, it's not. Uh, he's not going to feel disrespected by it. He knows. It. I'm lucky for some people. He's lucky for other people. Yeah, no, no random on that. Michael Thomas, uh, interesting. This there, Julio Jones of nothing. Uh, Jerome Bettis uh, for the Steelers. Right, now I just got to work some uh, to two ninety nine. Work some Ravens down here. Work some Ravens down. Who that? Who that is? A, a Tyree Jackson to uh, ninety nine. Uh, to two nine or to six ninety nine. A uh, Trey McLaren. Ryan Burns to uh, six ninety nine. Uh, pen pals for Nick Bosa of the Niners. Nice card. Nice card for the Niners. He he probably he probably gonna be a I eight. You're probably going to be all right. And the pen pals are on card. Got a uh, girly to 49. Golf to 99. Chubb to 75. Robert Woods to 299. Uh, Jeffrey Simmons to 299. A Fred Warner. To uh, 99 for the Niners. Autograph style actionness. So so far no like college type businesses. A uh, Saquon 99, which I like. A uh, rip into 2.99.
Uh, two ninety a Garoppolo. Uh, some dude, Kyler Murray, pen pal autograph for the Cardinals. Not super familiar with him, but uh, maybe he, I, I don't know. Uh, Leonard forty seven. Uh, Benny Snell to six ninety nine. Two ninety nine and Ed Oliver. Daniel Jones. Those are unnumbered. It's. I mean, Bug Eye fan. Why not? James Winston, uh, patch type card. E to W. It's going to be a uh, fire case. Two ninety nine, a uh, Ridley. Finley to six ninety nine. Uh, Byron Murphy to six ninety nine. Biscuit to two ninety nine. Isaac Bruce for the Rams to seventy five. The dirty, cheating Rams. It's a uh, Ryan Finley to 95. All right, let's just slide these over. Oh, listen, I mean, we still got uh, like 14 uh, boxes out of this one to go through, so. Field vision for Aaron Donald to two ninety nine. A uh, Darrell Henderson uh, pen pals autograph. Oh, I, th I think we're gonna have I think we're gonna have all of the top four QBs in this one. I got a feeling. I got a feeling. Metcalf six ninety nine. Uh, Irv to eighty four. Uh, Darius Leonard to 53. A uh, Christian Wilkinson to two ninety nine. A another Darrell Henderson of just straight rookie status. A uh, Daniel Jones to ninety nine. Easton Stick autograph. One of the top uh, quarterbacks uh, to uh, one forty nine. Will be replacing uh, Drew Brees. Not Drew Brees. Uh, Uh, 
other dude. Phillip Rivers. Uh, dual Steelers to uh, 49. James Conner, single, double, double, single. Drew the G-Man, I still got so many cards to go through. So many. Rip into six ninety nine. Zeke to ninety nine. These weird die not even die cut, but like stamped cards. Rose into two ninety nine. Stick to everything. Got the uh, Jerry Rice two ninety nine. A uh, Kamara uh, Pro Bowl to uh, one ninety nine. Oh yeah, and every coach. Uh, that uh, six ninety nine uh, Miles Boykin. It thinks they have got it figured out though with the uh, scrambling QB. Like their system will be uh, safe for them. It is the uh, is is the one that ends up just you know getting wrecked. It just they don't they don't work in the uh, NFL. Uh, Keneal Harry. As much as I dislike him, nice card to 25 for the Patriots. Only, only disliking him because he plays for the Patriots, but we'll pro we'll, we'll pro hopefully end up on my, uh, fantasy team as a, uh, late round pick. Uh, it's 299 and Emmett Smith. Derek Carr to 299. David Montgomery for the uh, Chicago Bears. Hockey organization. Demonte Adams to 49. Debo Samuel is six ninety nine. Saquon to two ninety nine. The uh, Deontay Johnson Steelers uh, autograph. Yeah, uh, Rashawn Gary to uh, six ninety nine. Rashawn Gary to two ninety nine. A uh, warning. To uh, twenty five, a uh, Riley Ridley. To uh, 25, a uh, Mayfield. A Weber to uh, 40. Have to move piles here in a second. A uh, Darius Slay to ninety-nine. David Montgomery uh, autograph to one at forty-nine for uh, the Bears. 
Let me move this over here. And I might as well move this over here. Don't be worried if people start uh, yelling new about you, Jeremy. They're just jealous of the uh, new guy mojo that uh, comes from being new. Gaskins to six ninety nine. McCaffrey to two ninety nine. That Kamara die cut that I uh, do not like. Josh Norman at 299. More of those messy die cuts. To 299, a uh, Thomas Brady. Goster in swatch form, craftsman style. A Daniel Jones, 699. <clears throat> Saquon is 75. Wentz, Swatchery for the Eagles. Thank you for your kindness, John. I mean, being uh, being welcoming and whatnot. Matty Ice to uh, two ninety nine. Hawkinson to two ninety nine. McLaren rookie card. Marshall Falk insert card. Why I'm uh, even telling you. I don't know, but uh, I'm telling you anyway. Uh, just he'll do uh, six ninety nine. Uh, Darwin uh, Thompson is six ninety nine. Bosa to ninety seven. Irv to two ninety nine. All right, that should take us halfway through. Should take us halfway through. <clears throat> we'll see if I. Uh, if I main if I maintain my composure for the rest of this. Rossberger to uh, ninety nine. A Devin Singletary for the Bills. Pen pal on card autograph. Come on, Ravens. Need to see some Ravens. Drew Locke to six ninety nine. Daniel Jones at two ninety nine. Lindstrom to ninety nine. Show me the Ravens. Singletary to sixty for the Bills. Roquan autograph to ninety nine for the Bears. Bears continuing uh, to uh, crush. Back to the future, Roquan. 
autograph hot fanciness. Aaron Jones to 49, three color craftsman uh, swatch action. Pack attack. I all as much as I dislike the Raiders, a uh, Gaskin is two ninety nine. I think I'm gonna have to watch Hard Knocks just to see the dumpster fire that it's gonna be. Because they have got some terrible folks on that team that are gonna be a mess. Mayfield two ninety nine. Russell Wilson uh, swatching it out for the uh, Seahawks. A DeAndre Baker rookie card, because that's what everybody wants. And a, Deion, a uh, Haskins, a 25 uh, for the Redskins. Got the uh, Quadre Olsen to six ninety nine. Brian Burns to ninety nine. Still time. Jersey G man, still time. I believe in myself to do this for you. If not, then I will just leave. Start walking home uh, immediately. Michael Thomas, uh, Saints, Swat Tree. Thorson, 299 for the Eagles. Probably going to be taking uh, the Eagles' starting job. If I had to guess, Justice Hill, 699. Trace McSorley to uh, 699. Probably going to be taking the uh, Ravens job. A uh, Hakeem Butler for the uh, Cardinals. Pretty much the only Cardinals autograph that you really, really want is that guy. Michelle to 49. Debo to 699. Stafford to 299. Thomas, uh, Fancy Hotness. Hey, Sammy Watkins, uh, die cut to uh, 86.
Devonta Adams to uh, 83. There it is. There's your Drew Lock autograph to 99. All right, so we are uh, heading there for all of the uh, top guys so far. Getting close, getting close, getting close. Broncos, Drew Lock. And Jerry Rice at 299. Lamar Jackson to 92. Non auto. Need auto. A dual Nick Bosa and Debo Samuels for the Niners. Trey, popping a little, popping a little something, something with the uh, double Niners action. Already got, already got the single Bosa, and I got the Bosa Samuels dually. That's uh, Isabella to uh, six ninety nine to ninety seven a Christian Wilkinson to twenty five a uh, Josh Jacobs Ah, uh, you're not a dumbass. Saquon insert card, which I'm sure everybody was uh, highly interested in, as much as they are in the Bo Jackson insert card. No Karrion Johnsons yet. Uh, H.E. Brown, 6 dollars I'm still working on that. Uh, Olsen to uh, 699. Working on a fistful of uh, autographs for a lot of a lot of different folks right now. A uh, 299 Irv Smith. Really, what I require a Gary Jennings Jr. is a 101 for the Ravens right now to 199. Gary to one ninety nine Jennings to one ninety nine Junior to one ninety nine. Uh, it all greedy. Greedy not being greedy though with uh, with this stuff Zeke to two ninety nine. Go mix into two ninety nine. Eating some uh, W's along with that uh, swatch for uh, Winston. So he ha he hungry. He hungry. Uh, Matty Ice at 299. He got to eat, sons. I mean, that's, I mean, that's just all there is to it. He got to eat. Mayfield to uh, 75. There have been a ton of those Mayfield insert uh, cards. Isabella for the Cardinals. Autograph. I mean, you know, he looks fast with that haircut. Like he 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 purposely cut off much of his hair so that he would be 
in fact, quicker to uh, run routes and whatnot. I drew sample to uh, 699, and I I appreciate that. Irv 299, my homies 299. Landstrom to T ninety nine. I mean, Landstrom's a hard hit. If you want to talk about uh, hard hits, it is not easy. Not easy at all. Rivers to uh, forty nine. I'm a hard hit too, honestly. A uh, Tony Pollard to uh, one forty nine for the boys. If I was drafted by the Cowboys or Giants, I would decline and I would clean toilets instead. Just as a just as a heads up. Because so many of you were asking about my you know, what I would do in that situation. Now you know. Caden Smith six ninety nine. Zeke two ninety nine Rosen ninety seven. Pat McAfee to 299. I mean, that one I was kind of, I was waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting to see. Russell Wilson Swatry for the Sea Chickens. Ed Oliver to 699. Does McAfee have autographs in this? I would not be hyper surprised. Joe, I would not be hyper surprised. 25, a uh, Gary Jennings Jr. for the uh, Sea Chickens type team. Well, now I feel like I feel I feel like I got like I got to find him for you. Uh, Damian Harris, 699. I kind of like that the rookies are only numbered in this. Kirk Cousins is 99. I mean, the 699 is what it is, but it's kind of nice that they're uh, that they're only numbered. DeAndre Hopkins, uh, Swatry to 49. Drew's G-Man, I don't know what I can do. I mean, I'm try I try to keep it like up as much as I can, 
87, a Foster Moreau. So my light situation is difficult. Uh, McLaren to 299. I mean, sometimes i got to turn it to see the number. I don't have a choice. Uh, to uh, Rocky Sin, 699. Sean, I'll just I'll just hunt him down. Find out where he lives, show his house, and be like, "You're gonna give me an autograph, and you're gonna give it to me now." Coleman to uh, two ninety nine. Irv Smith autograph for the Vikings to uh, one ninety nine. Irv. Good old Irv. We used to play. We used to play uh, church league basketball together before he, before he moved to uh, ninety nine. A uh, Winfrey. To be honest, he was never that good at it. I mean, I mean, he. I mean, he was a decent ball player, but he could not. Uh, he, he could he could not defend the pick and roll like he just could, couldn't couldn't like couldn't switch uh, couldn't switch defenders. Yeah, yeah Ingram to uh, seventy eight. Me Cole Hardman, perhaps the uh, this year's Riley Ridley, maybe, maybe perhaps. Ooh, I'm gonna I'll have to I'll have to check him out. Oh, SOB Will Greer again to uh, 49 this time for the uh, Panthers. Watt to uh, 99. Uh, oh, Jerry Cook to 87. Not a, uh, not a Brandon. Easton Stick! Pen and Pal uh, autograph. I don't know. I mean, I think, I mean, they're going to drive Newton into the ground. I mean, honestly, I mean, I, I, I think Joe... Drake to 49. I mean, he he he's gonna have to be hurt again before before they uh, before they before they make a change there. A uh, Fletcher Cox to uh, 91. I will do it. An Aaron Donald uh, to 299. Come on. Irv to six ninety-nine. How long to uh two ninety-nine? Uh Raiders. Never cared for the Raiders. Kittle to two ninety-nine. This is now or never for a lot of people. Foster Moreau to two ninety nine. 
Hurd at six ninety nine. Gaskins at six ninety nine. Yeah, yeah. Ingram to ninety nine. And there she is. Straight screwball deal for Jersey G-Man. Autograph-wise, we have got a uh, Easton Stick for the Chargers. Will Greer to uh, 49 for the Panthers. Miko Hardman, uh, I think, will end up being a very nice one for the Chiefs. A uh, Irv Smith for the uh, Vikings to uh, 199. <coughs> Excuse me, Pollard to 149 for the Cowboys. Isabella for the Cardinals. Uh, Gary Jennings to uh, 199 for the Seahawks. Drew Locke to 99 for the Broncos. Nice card. Cream Butler uh, Cardinals. A uh, Roquan Smith to 99 for the Bears. Nice card. Singletary for the Bills. A uh, Montgomery to uh, 149 for the Bears. Uh, Deontay jo Johnson uh, for the Steelers. Dave Montgomery for the Bears. Another Eastern Stick to 149 for the Chargers. Uh, Daryl Henderson uh, for the Rams. Isaac Bruce, 75 for the Rams. Nice card. Fred Warner to 99 for the Niners. The uh, Bosa for the Niners. Put that in the top loader. A uh, Fenley for the Bengals. A uh, Will Greer to 75 for the Panthers. Then we had uh, dual uh, autographs for Bosa and Samuel. Had a uh, Keneal Harry to 25 for the Patriots, which should be a very good card in the future. And the uh, Kyler Murray uh, Cardinals. Pen pal on card. Hot fanciness. Thank you, everybody. We'll get this one out too.